Well, I, I mean, as I understand it, the current government is going into the election as a sort of a ticket. I, mean, I wouldn't go so far as to call it a dream team, but uh, they're, they're joining forces and asking mm. people to vote for them as a government. Um, I think if the people reject that government, I couldn't see any circumstances whereby Renewa would be available to prop up a government that's been rejected by the people. But what if they come mm. and deliver us on some of these ideas that you're, you're um, espousing? I think it'd be. I, I just think it'd be very difficult. Um, I mean, what we intend to do is publish a very clear and very explicit red line issues before the general election, mm. and um, and we will only negotiate on that basis, and we will only enter government on that basis. Okay, so, so that's Fine Gael and Labour gone. What about Fianna Fáil? Um, Likewise, I mean, you know, I, I hate to say it, it disappoints me to say it, but there's no difference really between Fine Gael and Fianna Fáil anymore. So, um, you know, tw Tweedledum, Tweedledee, it makes no difference to me. For us, it'll be, about, it'll be about policy, it'll be about what we could achieve in government, and that's the only consideration. Sinn Féin? Well, we have nothing in common with Sinn Féin. Um, okay. You know, we don't support its, its violent tradition, and uh, we, um, from an economic point of view, Sinn Féin want to punish entrepreneurs, punish small business, um, drive up taxation. That's not something that we subscribe to, so um, I can't see any circumstances where we would have anything in common with Sinn Féin, so there's no likelihood or no prospect of us entering coalition with them. Thank you.